There's no doubt that Australia is big on big things. We've got the big banana, we've got the big pineapple, we have the big prawn. But I'm on my way to see something else that's big. It's most certainly not made of fiberglass. I've taken a slight detour in my travels to pop into Glencoe, about 30 kilometres from Mount Gambier in South Australia. I'm here to visit a steer called Big Moo, who might just be the biggest cow in the world. <laughs> just, it's amazing. Yep, Big Moo's owner Joe is 162 centimetres tall, average height. But with Moo's shoulders hitting the 190 centimetre mark, this guy wow. would make anyone look small. Joe, in my heart, I was hoping I wouldn't be disappointed. And <laughs> I'm not. I don't know how to say it, Moo. You were every bit as big as I thought you'd be. How did you ever come to, to own Big Moo? Well, Big Moo came to us like many cows. And we were going to hand raise him and pop him in the freezer. Don't listen, Moo. And... <laughs> that got your attention, didn't it? It did. And um, he was just such a lovely cow. He's the nicest cow I've ever come across. And we couldn't do it. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> At all. No. He's not friendly. Moo, behave. <laughs> His nature yes. won you over in the Absolutely. end. Absolutely. I've met a lot of cows, but I've never met one quite as, as smoochy as this. Oh, yes. He loves a smooch. And if he's laying down, you can lay down with him and climb on him and he purrs like a cat, I'm sure. Yeah. I grew up around cows, but they come up to here. Yes. <laughs> he used to be that high when he was about three months old. Yeah. <laughs> so how old is he now? Seven years old. Has he just kept on growing? We think so. But I mean, that's interesting, medically, I mean, to put yes. my best hat on. You do get giants in the animal world, but what happens is the little pituitary gland inside the brain just continually produces growth hormone. So they just keep on growing. The classic sign of gigantism, big feet. Yep. Big foreheads. Yep. Big jaws. Right. Don't make a comment. No, I won't. I was thinking it, but I won't say it. Thank you. <laughs> and Moo does have a lot of those features. Yes. He's got an overly Overactive. active pituitary gland. Oh, good. <laughs> Joe does have some normal-sized animals on the property, but even the horses walk in the shadow of Big Moo. They are dwarfed. They are dwarfed. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they cannot get as big as Moo. How do they get on? They get them fantastically, but the horses are always the boss. Yeah. You'd think his size would intimidate them a bit, but no. I've never felt so small in my life, but my heart has never been as swollen. I, you've just made my year. Oh, that's lovely. So thank you very much. <laughs> thank you for coming. It's been great to meet you and equally as fantastic to meet Big Moo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Bye, Moo. Just one more.